it wouldn't be a true Pride Month without a Sam and Christy video. There's a face of pride. <laughs> they really are. Yeah. Very yeah. expressive, shall we say. Yeah, hot couple. So that's what this video is going to be. It's, it's pretty much just going to be Sam and Christy spam. Uh, because we haven't done a video in a while, so we thought perfect to do it. And also, they've been together recently, so we're going to get to that. But but also, you know, the World Cup starts in 40 days? 40 days? And so we are getting pumped for that. And also, Sam and Christy made it official at the, at the Olympics partnership as a couple, as a girlfriend. Hashtag Who, sportsmanship. Who is going to be next? Because oh, yes. it has to be someone, because... Viv and Beth came out as a couple during the Euros last year. Mm -hmm. So there's going to be some big quaking <laughs> this summer. I'm telling you, I have my eye on a couple of people. Some people slid in the DMs telling uh. me who might be coming, uh, releasing their relationship. So <laughs> releasing their relationship. <laughs> <laughs> or And there's also been a couple DMs about speculations, which I thought were very interesting. Okay, um, okay. So we, the World Cup is coming. So we're going to talk about Sam and Christy. And I think the last time we talked about Sam and Christy was when they had the big interview a couple months ago. They had gone to Australia for Christmas and the New Year. So they went to Sam's hometown, home country, and they went there. And then it was kind of like after that time, Christy was in, Christy was her off season. So she was able to spend a good amount of time in the UK. You know what I mean? Yeah. Just hanging out. Actually, I just saw this on t um, Tumblr, but they got tattoos together. I'll, I'll show the pictures. That's <gasps> Christy's tattoo. Gosh, this is real. This um, is real. Yeah. Look at that fine line work. That's very pretty. It's like, it's like for, a bunny. Is that for, yeah, is that for Justin Bieber? Or? Oh, because I was like, baby, <laughs> baby. And then Sam got something. I'm not exactly sure what Sam got. I see her with her hand. So they were doing a lot of things. But that, I mean, th those don't look like couples tattoos per se. But, they, you know, they're getting tattoos together. Okay, together, but not together not yeah like a couple's tattoo. did you just see that i saw a tiktok about it saying like the moment someone gets a couple's tattoo the really a couple's tattoo yeah. the relationship's over even if it's like friendships Ew. i saw this one thing uh, this friendship got a matching tattoo less than 48 hours they had broken up their friendship <laughs> I don't personally know people who that's happened to. I know you do. I was thinking that too. Yeah, some good friends of mine. <laughs> but that is a very sexy, very sexual picture right there. Calvin Klein model. <laughs> what? Yeah. And then uh, Sam and Christy were just in uh, in the UK together for a good part of before Christy had to go back for the NWSL season. I'm going to flash pictures. I don't know if this will be in order, but we'll just kind of flash them once there and I will kind of talk about them. I see this picture right here of Sam and Christy both in on a black. Is that an elevator? Elevi <laughs> oh, is that an elevator? Classic. Or, no. Is that a bathroom? <laughs> I thought it was like a toilet paper holder, but no, that's sink. That's sink. Very bougie. Quintessential bathroom pick. And right? then another date night. They are the queens of date nights. Like, oh. they love date nights. A little kissy kiss picture right there. Love it. Um, Christy is the queen of the mirror selfie. Like, yeah, I'm calling Christy the queen of the mirror selfie. Yes. Am I right or am I wrong? That that sounds accurate to me. Yeah. And if I looked like Christy, I would be the queen of the mirror selfie. Too. I know, right? I would just have a mirror just in front of me. So I understand that completely. <laughs> but look, at they have sushi and Sam's no, being... I'm hungry now. Yeah, sushi and oh, Sam's walrus. being a walrus. Very cute. Classic um, walrus. Who hasn't done that? <laughs> with the chopsticks. <laughs> so just hanging out, Christy supporting uh, Sam yeah. at a Chelsea game. And I mean... Sam had quite a year at Chelsea. I mean, she was killing it this year. Um, so she was there supporting. And also, it looks like Christy was there even training herself. You know, she is, Christy is gearing up to be hopefully selected for the World Cup. So she has to keep fit. And NWSL, of course. Then they had to depart from each other. You know, when, you, when you're in a long distance relationship, it always comes to that point. And here is a picture already. It says, miss you so much already at Sam Kerr. And Sam is eating. Sam was eating. I thought that was a flash chicken. <laughs> but it looks like Christy's yeah. either in the airport or maybe even the plane. And um, Sam is already eating. <laughs> I mean, you need protein. You need That's to bulk true. up as, a, as an athlete. So, I believe back. I believe by the time Valentine's Day happened, Christy was already back in the states. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure she was. But here's a video. It says, "Happy Valentine's Day with my love." Are they chapsticking it up? I don't know what or is, is going on there. 
Or is that lipstick? I think it's a lipstick. And then Sam says something. It looks like Sam didn't want to miss out on some of the lipstick action because... <laughs> Maybe Sam just still likes to be pampered from Christy, having Christy do things for her. So she's like, put some lipstick on me, too. Because Sam really isn't the lipstick type, you know? Or Sam was very drunk. Nah. <laughs> yeah, it could be that. could be that. But uh, but that's, I mean, those are, those, are, those are wifey videos right there. Very cute. Very cute. We're going to show those to the great. Great grandkids. Exactly. <laughs> Very cute. That's actually a really cute video. So then they have Valentine's Day. Then it was actually Christy's birthday. Uh, yeah, it was February 25th. It's February 25th. And February 25th. And then Christy actually uh, Instagram a picture of Sam's gift. And they are these beautiful white, I believe they're roses, beautiful white roses. Oh, um, pretty gorgeous beautiful love pink the pink uh tissue um but then also she has this little letter and the only thing you can kind of see from the letter is oh, no. the little note the thing you can see though i think it's very interesting what does she call christy Kristen. Kristen. it's so funny and it says Chris, well we can read of it. it says Kristen, you are the love of my life happy birthday i think um but she i don't know if she normally calls her Kristen, but it's so funny because Christy is such not a Kristen. Like, you know what I, I mean? She's, she's such a Christy. Such a Christy. Because well, it's like a, such a celebrity thing. Like, yeah. like, uh, like the public knows you as a certain name. Yeah. And then, but you're close friends and you're a significant other. They call you like, something. Your yeah. stage name and your real name. Yeah. Or like, it's kind of like when you're trying to be cute or serious, be like, Kristen, Kristen, you know, Ooh. or sexual, Kristen. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> you know what I mean? It's just like, yeah. or like when your mom says, or like when someone says someone's whole name, like, Oh, that's when I know I'm yeah. in trouble. Oh, when you're in trouble. But it's cute if she does call her Kristen because I love, you know, but it's very cute. And this is you're the love of my life. So cute. I mean, I love that cute picture. Everything about that. But so, yeah, it was her birthday. So, And then also Sam uh, posted a cute birthday message to Christy. It was that happy birthday, my love. Can't imagine life without you. Three years older than me. Don't forget it. <laughs> and also happy birthday, Mac, which it's Mackenzie Arnold, I guess the same day. Um, but it's her birthday too. She has a cute picture of her and Mackenzie at the very end. Um, but super cute pictures of them together throughout the year. Uh, super cute. And then Christy goes, also 2.5 years. Literally shut up. <laughs> Mommy. <laughs> oh, Christy's hair looks extra. Baby spice. Baby spice. Yeah, extra like pop pretty. star. Pop star. Um, Sarah and I, I saw a picture of Magdalena Erickson recently with a middle part. I, I'd only known her from a side part. And I told Sarah, he goes, Sarah, look at Magda with a middle part. She looks like a pop star. Total pop star. Like total, like so young like and she fresh. She on Eurovision. Yes. <laughs> yes. But same, Christy has a nice middle middle part there with nice bouncy hair sam looking amazing and then sam sam has such a style that's such a cool girl like effortlessly cool oh you just described me oh dear oh dear um, <laughs> someone call that swag yeah oh that's true um and then cute picture there of just sam and christy baying it out get it <laughs> <laughs> you're wild right now a little bit okay so i mean those are some big things um from the last few months obviously they they have been apart so the long distance here's one um christy saying missing you her and sammy i bet they have like a million pictures i together. know i would love like, to see their camera that rolls photo album is thick <laughs> and then um even like on then in april christy posted this cute this cute picture it says i'm always sappy on wednesdays that was a cute picture of her and sammy kissing <laughs> adorable with her iced coffee in one hand sam in the other and that leather jacket leather jacket exactly nice. and then she goes i love you so much and th so that's really cute and then in the comments sam goes 34th last wednesday apart <laughs> but I who's don't... keeping track <laughs> yeah i know sam goes miss you love you um, so obviously they're always thinking about each other, each other throughout the season because you could, you know, they can't be together too often. And I think about this time, I don't know exactly when this came out, but, um, there was actually a Matilda's documentary and it was following, I did not see it. I think it's on Disney plus or Paramount plus, I think Disney it's on plus. Disney plus and we don't have Disney plus, but I saw some clips of the documentary and they were following. And obviously one of the major players are following is Sam. Is, 
the World Cup's going to be in Australia slash New Zealand, but probably one of the biggest female athletes in Australia, too. You know, so they had this uh, documentary and there was a little part with Sam and Christy. I saw it on TikTok. I bet I can't play it on this our video because for copyright. But if you go on TikTok, there's a, a TikTok account that will bring it up and you can see it. But I mean, they were, they were wifey eating it up. Sam was yeah. cooking for Christy. <laughs> She said she wasn't that good of a cook, but then she cooked some eggs and avocado. Hey, everybody can make avocado toast yeah. and <laughs> eggs. And so they were making that. And then uh, then Christy was saying really, really sweet, cute things about Sam. And then Sam got like this blushing. She was so blushing, kind of in a way, get like shy. She got so yeah. shy um, because she was spending time with Christy. And I don't exactly know when that was filmed. I feel like it was filmed a long time ago. Like it was like last season. And then about, at this point, about two, three weeks ago, the WSL season ended. So their season goes until the end of May. And Chelsea, they won the WSL title. They killed the season. Or Sam had Sam had a great year. She um, actually won, Sam Carr collects the, w, the FWA Women's Footballer of the Year Award. Um, for the second consecutive year, Sam Kerr attended the Football Writers Association Awards, where she was presented with the prestigious Women's Footballer of the Year honor on Thursday night. So she had a great year. I mean, such a prestigious honor. She was there. She made she made like a speech. Um, she had a great year. And then the very last game she played for the WSL season was on the 27th, I believe. They played Reading, and that locked up the WSL title. So they won the title. It locked it up. They were producing kind of on Instagram where they were kind of partying a little bit. Yes, yeah, so, yes, it was our entire feed. They were having so much fun. They were like, you know, it was also Mags and Pernell's last game with them and everything. Yeah, so extra special. Extra special. But that was on the 27th against, against Reading. They won the title. Then the very next day, Sarah, the very next day, Sam was at Christie's game. Oh my god! At Audi Field because they played. Uh, they played Spirit Traveling um, Woman. She the very next day, so she probably what? had a hangover. <laughs> yeah, does Sam Kerr ever sleep? And she was at the game again. She was there, and Gotham, I believe, won or tied. They might have tied that match actually. I think they won. They, she was there, so not you know she could have had more. And I know a lot of times teammates will go to like on holiday together after the season, but all Sam said, she goes, I don't want to go on holiday. With the teammates, I love my teammates, but I want to be with Christy, the love of my life. <laughs> yeah, that's what, right. Yeah, that's what she said. She wanted. Um, so then that started a few weeks of her being with Christy, and we're gonna go through some of the pictures. But that started weeks of her being with Christy, Christy, food, everything. Um, and then look at I believe this even looks like it's in the airport. Did Christy go straight from the game or go straight to meet her at the airport? I mean, those were airport seats, and they're they're getting a burger already. <laughs> That's how much they wanted to see each other. Um, I Christy picking her up at the airport and getting food at the airport. I mean, I'm thinking it's the airport just because it really looks like the airport. And then here's a cute picture. It says waited for months for this coffee date. So there you go. She's already <laughs> back waiting months. And that's it. Coffee date. Hey, for your love, you'd wait a lifetime just to have another cup of coffee with them. Exactly. Here's a cute video of Sam going to, it looks like the grocery store, like, uh, somewhere to get milk she goes why is everything so big in this country <laughs> looking at the milk and stuff she probably wants like a little quart of milk um i you know what it's funny because sam lived in the u.s for seven years or so you know she lived in the u.s for a very long time um but you never can get you never can get used to something that maybe is the only place in the world maybe has such large quantities of things like the u.s yeah you know everything's bigger in america yeah it's like we're all texas or something yeah <laughs> So those are cute moments. And then even here, Sam recording Christy watching, I think like the Real Housewives reunion or something. So Christy's really into that show, it looks like. And Sam is probably going along as a nice wife. Then we have a cute picture here. Uh, them just twinning out with their shoes. And then he, iced coffee. I mean, it's a date. Iced coffee date right there. And Christy has her coffee all ready for her. Oh, that looks so good. I know. Coffee. So refreshing. Nice little kiss. Um... So they've just been hanging out. Here's some more pictures of them um, walking down the street, enjoying this time together, kissing. Then this is a classic Sam and Christy picture. Sam, Christy posted this a few days ago. And I mean, don't you remember that other Christy picture we have where Sam and Christy were kissing at night? I think kind of in that same area. Um, Christy posted this six days ago and she goes, my love. It's such a cute picture. I mean, that is a Sam and Christy classic picture. 
quintessential Sam and Christy picture. It really is. Like that's their that's their thing. Yes, I like, mean, if I had to sum them up in one photo, that's them. It's, it's them. Agree. Agree. They're it. It's like they're each other's dream girls. They're each other's dream everything. Mm, dream boat. Dream boat. Yes. Um, and I, and I love that picture. I mean, it just you're right. It sums them up. And I always, I always, I still always get a chuckle about how much taller Christy is. I know. <laughs> I you love almost it. Think, uh, the Sam opposite. is taller. Yeah, yeah. Um, but I love that picture. And I love the little leg, leg little kick. kick. Up. Yeah, yeah. That's little so, leg pop. What movie is that? God, what movie is that? Has that never been kissed? No, Princess Diaries. Oh, it is. Oh, okay. <laughs> Where she wants to get kissed and put her leg up, and then it gets caught. So this picture was posted six days ago um, and super cute. And she says, my love. And I always find it, I don't know if interesting. I don't know what the word is. Some of the comments are, is, are they gay? <laughs> <laughs> you know, everybody's just no, laughing they're, they're just exploring. Yeah. <laughs> they're just <laughs> having fun. Someone goes, nah, sisters. <laughs> yeah, right? Sisters are sisters, best friends. And then someone goes, no, they're roommates. Ah, oh, hey, there you go. <laughs> and then you still get the haters. I mean, it says, oh, Jesus, what the f- what the F is this S? It's just like, I, but that's why I love Sam and Christy. You know, they're like, we're going to go out there. We're going to be extra because being extra, y- we're not going to hide our love. Because a straight couple goes on social media and gives a kiss. Nothing. You know, it's like, oh, beautiful. But we want to see it. We are here yes. to see it. <laughs> so, but I think... Yeah, so people are loving it. And then, of course, and it's like we said at the beginning of the video, it is Pride Month. So, of course, they have to give us the goods. Also, they just have like iconic pictures like this during their time. I mean, whatever they're eating, I'll take. (laughs) It looks like a chicken parm sandwich. Yes, that looks so good. I love Absolutely, I'll take that. I just ate and I'm extremely full right now, but I would. This, (gasps) that's like an Italian sub. sub. Yes. Italian grinder. Yes, Mm -hmm. that looks so good. Christy, I'm hungry again. <laughs> I love Christy. Is such like obsessed with food, whether it's sweets. Yeah. She appre- no, a food appreciator. Totally. She appreciates she appreciates food so much. And I'm telling you, New York has the best food, and in- you can get anything in New York City. And some of the best food you in can the even whole get a pizza wrap. Yeah, <laughs> pizza. Fry that up. You can. You can. <laughs> Uh, but so fun. So that was six days ago. And they've just been kind of posting pictures together because their time's limited, you know. Or the other night, it was Gotham's Pride Night. It, they played San Diego. It was uh, the Pride Night and Sam Crow right there. Super cute. Sam and Christy Ooh, at their Pride. Gotham did lose that game, which was the first loss in a long time. But uh, she goes, let's go, babe. And then they had a couple photo dumps because, you know, their time together is limited. Not only is their time limited, right now is the last part of their months or so that's not going to be st- completely stressful. Sam is going to go into the World Cup in Australia and be the most stressed I think you can be having the World Cup at home, having all the pressure on you. Doesn't she have that like hometown advantage? Can't yeah. she like relax a little you bit? Know, like, like, you know, they, she does, I know it's like extra pressure, but it's also yeah, like... Yeah, being at home, I think at you home. do feel a little more... You have your at family home. all there. You feel comfortable... Like anytime you're at home, you, you're you're right. You feel comfortable because you know your country so well, you know, and then you feel comfortable being in your home country. You know, that is true. You do have a comfort, but it's also stressful because so much pressure, too, because Australia wants them to, you know, come home with the wind. Also, um, for Christy, it's very stressful, too. You know, she's a bubble player. We don't know if she's going to make the squad. Leave a, a week of the 19th to 26th. I believe the U.S. is releasing their roster. So Christy, she did an interview on snacks with Sam and Lynn. And she basically said making the World Cup squad would basically put her career, her have a fulfilled career making that World Cup squad. Yeah, absolutely. She has had the wildest career in U.S. women's uh, national team history. The wildest career, you know, know. being such a up and coming talent. Then going off the radar of the national team then getting hurt then making a comeback and making the olympic team now possibly making the world cup team so obviously obviously we're rooting for her we love her story she's under a lot of pressure too but i will say um vladko did say you are going to make her the squad based on your club play and uh gotham has been killing it there they were in first place for like or two weeks and Christy's been playing really, really well. So if that is what he said, that you're going to make the team based on your club play, 
Christy made the team based on her club play alone has been really, really good. Yeah, hope so. So we are rooting for them. Um, so they posted that six days ago. Then Sam posted three days ago. And it was just worth the wait. And we'll go through the pictures. And it's just her and Christy was wait, just cute pictures. We're just going to flip through them. You I'm know what? I'm trying to see how the arms are going. No, Those I'm... arms are who? Oh, yeah. They're a little bit like <laughs> mishmash. And then a cute picture. I don't know if they're on a plane. Maybe they're on a plane somewhere. Oh, maybe it's the plane from, I don't know. They're on a plane. They're looking cute. Um, fresh faces. <laughs> Sam looks tired. Christy with the space buns. We haven't seen that look on her. But both in black. Love that. It's my favorite color. And their apartment, um, Christy's apartment's looking a little messy. I like that mirror. <laughs> I like, love that mirror. Cute picture. This was before, you know, Sam's always going for that kiss. Oh, yeah. And then Sam with, uh, that looks like Sam Mewis's dog. Six hours ago from when Sarah and I were recording, Christy posted one more photo dump. And it says, and the countdown begins again, which I'm guessing that means Sam is leaving uh, to go back. To go wherever she's going, whether mm-hmm. it's Australia, going back to the UK, uh, getting prepared for the World Cup because Sam's season, the WSL season's over. But a quintessential Ooh, Sam and Christy. Oh, I like this caffeine and dreams. Yeah, isn't that cute? Where are they? That is a cute. Oh, and look at, that is so cool. Look at the, the where they sit. It's like cinder blocks. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Hey, cinder block man. Yeah. <laughs> And then Christy outside with her ice. Co- Christy's iced coffees always look the same. They look like a very dark roast with just like a splash of like probably almond milk or oat milk. Like That's they look the way pretty dark. Be drinking it. I know it's the healthiest Perfect way. Like then more food, Sari. More food. Oh, okay. This looks like a bagel. Wild, like a, like a, a bagel. Yes. <laughs> Came for Sam and Christy, stayed for the food. Yeah, <laughs> exactly, exactly. <laughs> and I just ate. <laughs> exactly. Then Christy, you know, with the fit. I mean, Gotham has the best fits. Gotham um, or, um, and Rain. Gotham and Rain, best fits in the league. And uh-huh. LA. Uh, Angel City. Angel City, yeah. yeah. A cute picture of Christy and looks like they're in the back of a cab or something. More food. Them at the game, another picture of Sam. So the countdown begins. I'm guessing that is just they're going to split, you know, have to split up one more time until the World Cup. Cannot wait for the World Cup. A, I think Christy has a very good chance of making the team. I do. I think she's going th- to, I I think it's a very good chance based on her club play, if that's what they're also considering. Um, And then, you know, Sam being a star, you know. And remember with the interview we read that, Christy in Australia gets some of the biggest cheers in Australia because they yeah. know she's dating Sam. Um, that must feel good for Christy too. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. Actually, there was a um, there was a storyline at the last World Cup where Sam Mewis, uh was at the World Cup and in the semifinals she was playing the English team which had Ra- Rachel Daly on it at the time and Christy was dating Rachel Daly at the time. That was kind of a storyline. Christy was like, "Who's she gonna root for in the semifinals? Her <laughs> girlfriend at the time or her sister?" I mean, you root for everybody. You root for right? everybody. I will say that, yeah. Why can everybody just win? But we live for these photo dumps. We live for them when they're together. Obviously, it's very serious. You know, they're have they're trying to make they're trying to have the best time relaxing as much as they can. Mm-hmm. You know, because even if they're both on the squad, you know, Sam's going to be there if Christy is on the squad. It's like just that pressure again pretty soon. And you mean you can't beat those kissing pictures. And so fun. Um, what does everyone think? Uh, I can't believe it was two years ago at the the launch of Sam and Christy Curmew. Cannot believe that was two years ago. Time flies. Time flies. They and also someone saw Emma Hayes at the Gotham game on Pride Night. I think. Yeah. And wonder what she was doing there. I mean, maybe Sam was there. So she, you know, it's a pretty it's a pretty quick flight between the UK and New York. Um, they were playing Wave, and I don't know if she's friends with Casey Stoney. Maybe oh, was I there. She was gonna join the squad. Oh, <laughs> you never know. You never know. <laughs> Some people think she might have been scouting Christy. I mean, you never know. Whoa. You never know. That would be wild. That would be wild. And obviously, you know, Chelsea's such a great team. But any m- member of the U.S. Women's National Team would be good for any team. You know yeah. what I mean? Best in the world. The rankings just came out for the U.S. Women's National Team. They're still number one. You know, it goes by points. And there's, you know, what does everyone think? Uh, what was your favorite picture of the section? Sexual couple. Yes, <laughs> totally. Wait. What does everyone think? Um, they probably will be separated one more time, but that is okay. But fun pictures. Anytime they do interviews together. Uh, and I think the story 
if Christy makes the team, I think there'll be a lot of publicity around them in general because World Cup, you get so much publicity to begin with, but Sam's going to be the biggest star at the, the games this summer, will be the biggest star, I think. And then also, if her girlfriend, just like Olympics, when that thing hit at the Olympics, every major media outlet was covering it seemed like once it kind of got rolling. Yeah. I think there's going to be a lot of, if Christy does make team, a lot of media coverage around them just dating and what it means and how you know how everything how wonderful it is oh, exactly question comments what down below what does everyone think very very special very cool hopefully happens we'll see if the next time they're together is is at the world cup so yeah we'll see. questions comments down below we'll talk to everyone later have a good night bye yay go gay